Welcome to the heart of the Thimble Islands, and specifically Rogers Island, one of the largest in the group. Rogers is privately owned, consisting of nearly eight acres, with a Tudor mansion that has 27 rooms. Douglas Elements' Melissa Frank Lutz gave us the tour. Did they name it this, or did was this the name since? This was the name. So this home was built in 1902. There's a lot of history here to this island and to this home. It's 13,000 square feet, all designed by the homeowner. A fun theme, light, bright, and informal. Everywhere you look. <laughs> yes. Those bright colors. It is so wild. Some original early 1900s elements include this wood-burning fireplace. In the kitchen, you'll walk on original wide plank floors. We have a commercial-grade Viking stove here, top of the line everything. So they're into pink and orange. They are. You will see that all throughout the home. I think it's such a happy home. How could you ever be in a bad mood here? Upstairs, 10 bedrooms. This is the master suite. A living room, a dressing room. This is crazy. It's like an orange burst or a lemon zest. You completely nailed it. Outside, you'll probably feel like you're at a resort, completely surrounded by water. There's an oversized pool and a pool house. This gazebo is one of my favorite views of the entire island. A stone path leads to a koi pond filled with fish. And a guest favorite, this English garden, exactly like you'd see overseas. They've had to have some major parties here, some weddings, different things. They have. They Actually, have. they have, yes. And a commercial greenhouse. So we have two docks. I mean, and look at this pier. This is a pink granite pier. So included in the sale of Rogers Island, we have a Victorian that sits on shore with a dock accessible just for this island. To live large on Rogers Island, it will cost you $35 million.